I tell you what, as a fourth generation San Franciscan, it won't come as a big surprise. I think it's the best city in the world. Whether it's our skyline, our views, our tourist attractions, we want to be as safe a city as we can. It wasn't that long ago. We were probably suffering from as much gun violence as any other big city per capita in the country. In the mid-2000s, our uh, average homicide rate was over 92 a year, which was uh, alarming because that had just not been the case for a long time. And most often when you're talking about homicide, you're talking about uh, the illegal use or the misuse of guns. For officer safety, it's really important that they know exactly where to go, not just some intersection. You're never quite sure when you got to the scene if the gunfire was still happening, and then you never knew really where the gunfire was coming from. So it was a lot of unknown. There is a low percentage of people that call in actual shots fired. I think a lot of people are desensitized because it happens frequently. You know, some people don't want to get involved, so they won't call. And now, you know, in a sense, they don't have to. In the mid-2000s, San Francisco started with the shot spotter system, and since then, our gun violence is down basically 50%. Shot spotter has been particularly helpful in lowering crime rates, and specifically homicides. We're at an all-time low of homicides for the past 30 years. Shot spotter has helped us because we know that we have forensic evidence that we can rely upon in proving that a shooting did or did not take place. We're able to prove almost the specific location of the shots that were fired, as well as the quality of the shots, the sound of the shots, how many there were, and how far apart they were. With ShotSpotter, I have more confidence sending the officers into the vicinity where the shots are fired. Charlie 77, show me respond to that 916. We respond a lot smarter, we respond faster. We know with better accuracy where the gunfire is located. So there's taking a lot of that guessing out of the game. And now we have the system that's reliable, it's accurate, and it just gives us a lot more information than you know a person calling in would give. And they do a fabulous job at making sure that we're getting real calls and not fireworks or motorcycles or helicopters and things like that. They say number one thing uh, that reduces crime, the fear of being caught. Well, we're catching the bad guys. Uh, we have great men and women that are doing the investigations. And, and as chief, I'm try trying to give them the best tools, Shot Spotter being one of them, to make those cases. You know, the bad guys, hey, they know if they fire off a gun, we're going to be there a lot quicker. So the chances of them getting caught, and they have been caught with this system, has, you know, gone up for us. And for them, maybe it makes them think a little bit, oh, do I really want to fire off that gun and possibly get caught? I don't think they want to do that. To have incidents of gun violence down 50% and homicides by proxy down almost 50% from where we were in the mid-2000s is uh, definitely going in the right direction.